hide me at all Cause where you go is where I go I don't need nobody else I got you And you got me too Good morning friends It is 6.20 In the morning um, I'm waiting on Lauren to get here to work out and little miss over here is chilling with her milk and cheerios and some good old kids youtube um when we first started doing this workout thing i so thought i could like do it without olivia waking up but she in the last week or so has been back in our bed like she wakes up and gets in our bed and I've been so tired like I just haven't even dealt with it um I took her upstairs the first couple of times but I like I just need my sleep so um and now that Ben's gone for a little while I don't really mind her being in bed with me but anyway I thought I could like sneak out of bed without her noticing but literally <laughs> I stayed in bed a little bit longer than I normally do um, and I kid you not at like 6.05 she sat straight up in bed reached over and like made sure I was still there so um, in the last two mornings I have snuck out and within five minutes she has been out here too so she's just uh, getting a little bit of an early morning but it's okay because she's been going to bed like perfectly at night um, no fussing or anything like that no getting up so that's been really nice. But anyway, we are about to do day three of T25, and I'm a bit sore, and a bit tired, and I'm going on day three of a headache. So I just ate a banana, and I'm actually going to take some Motrin this morning because my head is killing me. Yes, baby. Where is coming? What? Where is come over my house? Yeah, Lauren's going to come over to your house. We're going to work out, right? Yeah. I asked her if she just wanted to stay in my room um, and watch her iPad, but she was like, no. <laughs> um, she likes to be out here, but the only downfall to that is she also likes to whine a lot of the time, and she wants me to hold her. I'm not holding her during this workout, but anyway. She crossed off yesterday. I didn't knock that one off for whatever reason. Now this morning we're up early and we are getting our workout in. So we are doing, come on turn back on, total body circuit. Yeah, Shanti. Go live. Do your workout. Oh, yeah, yeah. I got you. Squat, live. <laughs> Go live, do it, girl. <laughs> Workout is done. Lauren stayed with the kids 
well, she stayed with Olivia. The boys are still asleep. She stayed with Olivia so I could run and grab some milk. I picked up some sausage patties and some breakfast potatoes or like home potatoes, whatever. Um, so that the kids can get full because like I said, the boys are just like starving all the time. So yeah, I'm just waiting for that to finish cooking. Then I'm gonna go get the boys up, feed them all breakfast, and then we're just gonna kind of hang out for a little bit. I don't think we have anywhere to go today or anything special. So I'm probably just gonna focus on trying to get my room straightened up. I have that uh, play pen or like the pack and play it's still full of laundry probably even more so than last time I showed you guys so I really need to get that undone because Ben was like it's still gonna be like that when I got back no it's not so yeah what you want the pillow gone you want me to move this or do you want it you want to lay on it yeah. all right sit up let's bring you back is that better yeah Okay, I just heard the boys, so I'm just going to quickly finish up breakfast and um, go grab them. Good morning. Where does that call from, Mama? What? Where did that call from? They came from upstairs. They were sleeping. Say we got sausage and potatoes, mm -hmm. and we're loving it. Yeah. All right, let's go eat. Come on. And Olivia has potatoes and sausage and bananas. I just marked off day three on my calendar for our workouts. Feeling pretty good. But yeah, it's been a pretty productive morning, but I am getting kind of tired. I try to drink this like protein, not a big fan. Um, so I think I'm gonna have some potatoes and I am going to drink some coffee. So really quick, in the middle of this vlog, I wanted to unbox and show you guys something super cool and something I'm super, super excited about. Um, I really didn't have like a great time to film these kinds of videos, especially now that Ben's out of town. And so I'm just gonna do it when I can. Yeah. So I just have to do it when I can, right? So this is what I'm unboxing for you guys. It is a video baby monitor and I'm so excited about it. It's literally like the coolest baby monitor I've ever seen and I'm totally not exaggerating. So um, thank you Lollipop for sending me this. Very sleek and very like, I don't know, it just reminds me of an Apple product. But anyway, so when you pull the top off, this is the actual baby monitor and I've been putting this off because I wanted to do this like really in-depth and like fancy video for you guys yeah there you go but I'm just like so excited and ready to use it so I'm just gonna do it now so when you pull it out this is the baby monitor it's really awesome um, this bottom part I like it this bottom like part it, bends. Mommy. Yes, it's really cool. It um, connects to an app. So your base for your monitor is your phone, which I thought was really cool. So then you pull this part out and underneath you have this card here and you just pull it out like this. And on the back it has like all of your installation instructions um, and all of that good stuff. It tells you how to um, like set it up. And then here is your little barcodes for um, the app. Then we have a bunch of little boxes under here. Hi. I wish you guys could see this. The twins are like right here at my like side and Olivia's like directly beside the camera. Anyway. So this is super cool. Please don't bite me. So this slides off and I thought this part was so neat so basically it's a wall mount but it looks like a little branch so you can attach this to your wall it comes with like an adhesive but you can also screw it in and then you just attach this and then the baby monitor itself just fits right down in here and you can like loop it around and make it look super cute I absolutely love how flexible this is it's so cute so you can loop it around like this and then you can just attach it to the wall or to a crib or anything like that and it's really cool now I really like this um, monitor and what attracted me to it was it's lot it has a wide angle lens on it so you see a lot more of the baby's room or the baby's crib than you do with like a regular baby monitor or at least the ones I've experienced and here this is I'm just unboxing this for the first time so bear with me you guys because um, I haven't looked at any of this either I'm really excited I kind of wanted to just do it like with you guys 
Okay, cool. There is a cord that runs from the back of the monitor um, down into what, wherever you plug it in at. And it's really cool because it has these, they have um, tape on the back as well, like adhesive, but you can um, use these to like line the cord through it, if that makes any sense. I'm super excited to try this out. I'm gonna um, go set it up in the boys' room and put them down for their first nap, and then I will um, show you guys what it looks like. So sorry that this review had to have my children included, but you know, it is what it is. Okay, so the app that you're gonna use is the Lollipop Baby Camera app. So just go into your app store. So this is the app that you're gonna want to download. So it is downloaded right here. So I'm just gonna open the Lollipop app. It says, would like to send you notifications, allow. So we're going to sign up. It's just like getting you to set up like basically a profile. So I'm gonna pick a photo. The really cool thing about this app or this baby monitor is that you can play music and sounds through, um, like through the baby monitor. So I'm gonna see if I can get it to work. It has different sounds like uh, vacuum cleaner, hair dryer, white noise, um, sea waves, water, the womb. Let's see if we can get it to play. Here's the hair dryer. We hear it. Sorry, hair. Olivia's like all up in the camera. That's what it looks like. I don't know if you can see through the glare, but. I'm filming you right now. Here's Olivia. Olivia, say hi. Hi. And the boys are playing over there. So see, it has a nice big wide angle. Um, let's see if I can, there we go, there's full screen. So it has a nice wide angle. I mean, that's like my entire living room basically. There's Kino. I'm really excited to try this out and I'll let you guys know more about how I like it. Um, after the boys nap. All right, so I have the boys down for their nap. There's Jacob and Jameson. And they are already knocked out. So I have it on mute. This is what it sounds like. I have their sound machine going in their room. So I like it so far and it does reach both babies right across the room from one another. I chose to put it on Jacob's side because he has like this big thick bar right here that makes it hard to see him. Like if I were to have it to where his crib was over here, I wouldn't be able to see him as well. So I can see Jameson really well. Um, and then I get a good shot of Jacob as, as well. If you don't want video to be on, you can switch to just audio mode. So it just has the sound and no video. Um, and then I can take a picture. So far, so good. Oh, there it goes. I don't know why it wasn't doing it. So it'll load the songs or whatever and I can play lullabies or I could do the sounds, uh, which they have a sound machine on, so I'm probably not gonna play anything, but I just wanted to show you guys that like it does have like classical music um, and then also the sound list, so that's really neat. I love it. Okay, so the consensus is that I love this baby monitor and uh, hello hello so when i don't have my phone in the app and i'm not actively looking at the babies or like what is she doing? <laughs> it burns she had an allergic reaction to something she got a little sore on her chin yeah you're so fragile you're so fragile yeah i know anyway so so basically, if you're not in the app and your baby cries or makes noise or it detects movement or anything like that, it will record a 30 second clip of the event. So um, so the camera is basically off if you're not like actively looking at the app, but it will turn on and record even if you're not looking if it detects noise or movement or anything like that. Um, and it showed me that it says no, uh, noise detection six minutes ago. So Jameson is over there in the corner crying, standing up in his crib. <laughs> so yeah, I think that that's pretty cool. He threw all of his pasties out of his crib, so he's kind of ticked off. But um, yeah, and um, Ben was able to, he's not in the state, but he was able to log in and see the babies. And I went upstairs and waved at him. So I thought that was really neat. But anyway, that is basically all I have to say about Lollipop. I think that it's awesome. I'm gonna have it linked down in the description box for you guys, but 
you need it. It's amazing, and I'm probably gonna go get another one. <laughs> We're gonna go see Cece tomorrow? Yeah, I'm oh, excited. I'm super excited. Oh my gosh, the mascara under my eyeballs. Anyway, I'm I super excited it. about I taking... I see it. I see it. Wow, yeah. I'm super excited about taking that monitor that with red. us. Mm -hmm. It's see. black under there, right here. Because usually I, I have to take a um, sound machine and a monitor if I want to be able to see the boys in their room at night. But this is awesome because it's a sound machine and a monitor and it just hooks to my cell phone, which is always beside me at night anyway. So that's Sorry, really awesome. Bye. I'm so bye. excited about this, Sorry, obviously. Bye. Charge come bye bye. I love you. I said go bye bye. Yeah, okay. I didn't realize that my hair tie was green. <laughs> Alrighty. Bye.